Dun, 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 dun. had an idea for how to fix this level we were working on last night, but I'm doing it in debug game because, oh, you know what, let's just launch it in the debugger because we were having this editor problem that we want to fix before people on the team start on Monday. And that's why you use your own things after making major changes as soon as possible. Because you catch these things. Sometimes. <laughs> Not always. Sometimes. Okay. Uh, we were on Bridgey 3. Bridgey. That's not going to be found there. We got to go here. Bridgey 3. Boom. And I had an idea for how to make this more of an original level and the idea was as follows I'm gonna get rid of all this stuff I don't know and we're gonna actually have the crossing be up north again okay I mean, I have so many different ideas for this level, who the fuck knows, but. I mean, I just had a cool idea for another part, but let's not worry about that. Okay, so. So the idea, we're going to have our same thing, and you're going to want to fill in a row up here. Let's even, let's, let's make it easy on the people. We might undo this later. But the point being, you want to put this up here so you could done bridge that gap. Now, the reason you want to done bridge that gap is because... Um, Let's get this out of here for now. There's, there's another layer to this here scenario. Uh, it is that you want to get on an upper level to get to the exit. Okay. And this upper level is reachable up here. Or down here, but you know what? That's actually we just carve it away on this side. So so you can get across up here. You can pull the thing. You can go up, and then and then you just waltz to the exit. Except of course, you do not just waltz to the exit because you have to prep some things. Now I drew this line directly over here, but in reality, it'll be something a little bit more, a little bit more organic like, okay? I mean, I kind of, okay, I kind of want to do, see, there's different tensions here. Let's, let's even, let's carve this shit away. Let's have this be down here. Okay. Like, I actually, I kind of want to do a cute, oh no, because, never mind, let's, let's ignore that idea. Okay, so. One idea that I have 
my idea about the brontosaurus we, we could even we could even select all these items and widen the gap a little here to give us more room I don't know I don't know guys the goal is You gotta you gotta line up the dudes to fill in the gaps in the wall, but you can't always do that. All right. So, um, for example, if the wall goes over here, you cannot fill in that gap right there. You got to do it with a mirror drop. And what does that mean? It means you need to get a stone down there. Now, the problem is, if the level looks like this, it's just very easy to understand that the stones all got to be on the right. In uh, This one, you just got to fill. That's fine. Um, Uh, this already looks shitty, but we'll we'll make it better. Um, this one you got to fill. This one you got to fill manually. Um, this one, okay. So we could also because because you're the plot is that you're trying to get to the goblin fortress for the all-out goblin war, obviously, right? So we want to have a funny thing where you could just walk down this unbroken wall. If only you could fill that one spot right there. Um, but that can't happen. Actually, that might be too obvious, but you know. You, you can't actually put stones further to the right than they are. There's no possible way. Um, let's, let's put a sign. Let's get a sign that has a mesh. Okay. So the idea is you do a bunch of stuff and then you pop out to this side, you could read the sign about the Goblin Fortress. And uh, yeah, so now, you know, the idea is we do this kind of thing to fill this gap up here, which means, for example, we need to be able to pull those stones uh, over to where they want to be. And um, like these stones could be like if you try to pull them out this hallway, right, you get trapped, but you could leave you could leave one here. And that's fine. Um, let me see how this works out. Because if I pull it this way and I can get around some way, then I can pull it this way to put that stack there. Right? And, and this is like the only the only three stack that you need. Okay. And then um, you need one. After that's blocked off, right? You just need one in this row. 
that you can manipulate from the other side to fill this in somewhere. Anywhere in here is fine, right? Um, and then, right, for this gap that you get through, you need one there. Okay, three, one. Uh, one, one, one. Okay, and the reason I'm going to do it this way, this is funny. Okay, this is a little bit rough because I can't actually, I can't actually get one to here. So we'll maybe get one to there. Okay, this is funny because you have to break these apart using the thing and then pull one out. Let me just, let me just try this. So we're going to go this way. We're going to go this way. Oh, I can't even, I need one more square to do my thing. Should I extend to the right or? Mm. Because um, let's get a little bit more of a elevated viewpoint here. Where did we start? The problem being, if I want to put this at the beginning, I need to get it out there. Oh, wait, I can. What am I talking about? I'm good. Okay, so I want to put that there. There, that's fine. Okay, now, the hilarious thing. I need like this here, let's say. And I need another one bagger. Wait, do I have too many stones? I need another one bagger like here somewhere. Oh, I could just leave that one. There. That's not very good. We don't want it to be that you could just leave that one. But we could fix that later. Uh, so. Oh, yeah, we need. Uh, yeah, this is sort of a problem. Once something comes off the wall, I can't get it out. This kind of sucks. Um, how bad is it if I get rid of this square? I feel like that square is important. Anyway, the idea was going to be that you get these guys out here and you go boop. All right, except now I don't have enough room to do anything. So that is a flaw in this plan. Um, if I move the exit one more over, then, I'm then I still can't do anything. Let's make a little more room down here. Okay, you know, actually the thing is, I don't have to do all this at once.
which kind of sucks. I don't like that. How about this? The way, oh, and you know, this is maybe too, I need to make that middle wider. Like, there needs to be, once I bring that mirror up, I need to not really be able to bring it south again. Because the whole idea of this level is supposed to be that it's premeditated. And if I can just do this and then go back and fucking do everything, that's not that great. I guess it doesn't hurt to get rid of that wall segment. It just makes it maybe less obvious what is happening. Anyway, the idea being that we do stuff like th this to fill in the wall, right? And then you could go. Okay, this is kind of interesting because once this is here, I actually can't get it forward. So actually we can, we can do this the other way around. That was a funny accident because I was like, how am I going to do this? And the answer is, the answer is that because Because now once I go down there, it's like fine that this guy is on a row, right? But if I even, wait, we didn't run the same level. If I even pull him out here, now I'm hosed. Because I can't, I can't get it up there. So we need to do this. And then I pull it across. And then once I've gotten it, that bridge down, I can't, oh, I can, never mind. I can do this. Fudge. I mean, we could just get rid of one more square. No, because even that doesn't work, guys. And the reason is, I could just leave this thing on the left line and do those stones. I mean, okay, the way to get super fucking contrived about all this is just, I don't like how forced this is now, but certainly I could do fucking that, all right? Watch me be a bad game designer and do bullshit. So now there's absolutely no, well, now I can't even get it up there. So that's a problem. Um,
Okay. So this is maybe a one-way door kind of a thing where to get it to get it into that row, I've got to come off the wall. And once it's off the wall, I can't get it back. Except for right here. But like all the stuff on the bottom has kind of got to be done. I mean, I'm not proud of that. I'm not proud of that, but maybe we can make it better later. Let's put a note. make the notes visible. I am not super proud of these obstacles, but they are to prevent you from getting the mirror back, back south. So stone arrangement must be premeditated. Maybe there is a better way to do this. Design notes. Okay. See, you can you can tell people why things are the way they are, and it only takes a second. It only takes a second. Okay. Other things we were gonna do. Move this guy. Make make some room down here. All right. All right. Let's see how that feels. So, oh, we were also, I guess, going to try that. Let's see how that feels. All right. So, I mean, it's easy clap still to get around here. So I put those in the place where I'm going to line them up. I then am going to do that guy and that guy. And I've already hosed myself, but we'll get that back later. So here I've got to break this stack, which is easy clap. Okay, now I've broken the stack. And uh, now I, got, I can't get it back through. Um, but this is actually, hmm. if I had one more, okay, undo, 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 undo. This is solvable. Like I was in the mode of changing. No, this is solvable. Here's how we do it. We go hide in the cubby hole and we break the stack. All right. And now we have this. All right. So we put that there. We put that there. And uh, I mean, so this is what's weird is actually what I just did, I th I'm pretty sure this is solvable now, right? Because I can pull that one into place. I don't need the mirror to place that one. I'm not sure if I like that. All right, so we do this, we come across, okay, this is already fucked. Okay, wait, we, we forgot steps. We come down here, we gotta place these guys, and 
Um, oh shit, that goes through the sign. That's that's bad juju. We can't really do that. Um, so I th I forgot something, which is um, I need I need to get across here. <laughs> Maybe we don't. Like, I, you just can't drag the mirror further into the zone or else that breaks the puzzle. Um, possibly this is fine, right? Possibly we do this. Um, I mean, I kind of even want one more square of space on the north. Also, why, why is that even there? Why is that not just like that? Okay, I f I feel like we actually could get away without that. Yeah. So these guys just need to be in this top line somewhere, and then they're fine. Um, and then we need a solo dolo. And again, I could, so I could add one more square of wall there if I wanted to. We need a solo dolo here. And we need there. Yeah, and then, then we gotta break this stack. Um, okay. And then we do this again to close the wall off. I mean, so so it is solvable. Oh no, I need to close the wall off from the other side. Okay, this is the one part that's kind of iffy to me. And the reason is bec because you would solve this on the other side. I just, it's it's kind of not tight if the level is about premeditating all your drops, right? Also this fucking sign situation we're gonna have to deal with. I think we can just move it one more south and that's fine. Okay, so that's good. And then schwack, schwack, schwack. And then now I can pull this in, but I kind of can't get into any more trouble here. Um, if I hadn't put that stone, let's for a minute mess up our solution and imagine if I hadn't put that stone there, then I could get this mirror inside and that, that would be bad. Like, because, whoops, because... Right now I can go here and solve. So there's two things I don't like. Whoops, two things I don't like. One is you can get the mirror inside. 
Uh, how do I block taking the mirror inside? Um, the answer is, so I wanted to use it to get up the wall. Like that's, that's part of the fun part. Um, like we need room to maneuver over there. What if you have to stack the stones of water to form a higher bridge? I thought about that. That would require way more stones. And the more stones you give, the harder it is to make a clean level. How are we planning on playtesting the game? By having people play the game and tell us what they think. Okay, so this is problematic. Okay. We don't want to be able to take this thing past here. Okay. I think what that means is... So, what if I have this? All right, so I should still be able to bring stuff around, but if I try to bring the mirror back, it ain't, it ain't going to go. It ain't going to go. I could only get up on the wall with it. Cannot see that that's the kind of little tweak that saves levels, everybody. Um, let's fix the frickin' sign thing. So here now we can, get, you can basically get the mirror down to where the sign is. Okay. So now the thing that I do not like, I liked it better when this was a clean horizontal wall, first of all. That extra square bothers me a little bit. Maybe not too much, because it could, like, ain't no reason it can't extend to here. And, and now it's like, okay, there was some kind of structures. And, I mean, maybe we even do this. This might be a little too much maneuvering for the player to have to do. But that is a thing that we could do. So, oh, whoops. So, pull this down. Pull, 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 pull. Pull. Okay. So that's fine. Oh, this might be rough. Actually, I like this better. Okay. You got to be a little more premeditated to get that one. We get this one. We break the stack. We pull that puppy in there. So this is my only problem with this level is you don't have to fill that one in via a thing. However, I like having the exit on the right. And you can't, like, you can do this, and that sort of uses the mirror. I just, I don't love it. 
There are seven stones and the gap is seven wide. The gap is six wide. I mean, like, it doesn't matter if you get across. Huh? That's a good point. Like if you if you make a straight line that all the stones could go across. Like, yeah, this is why this is why I didn't want to make a two level bridge, because that problem gets even worse. Um we could do a bunch of things. We could make it a too high gap at the top, but that that maybe lets makes the stacks less differentiated from each other. Um, if you make the mirror block start two blocks north, then you can't solve the level because you can't get to the left side of the map. Three blocks north. That still doesn't force you to fix, if you're talking about that in terms of filling in that south gap on the wall, it doesn't force you to fill it. Um, because you fill it on foot and not with a mirror, you can just come back on foot later. And the only way to prevent that would be to have the stone path that you build lock off all possible footpaths, which seems really hard. It doesn't kill the level. It's just I don't I don't totally love it. I don't really know. Like the problem is It's it's actually fine. You know what? We can also be more of a smart ass about the exit. and put it like here. I wonder if that's actually solvable. It might actually be by putting three stones here. So maybe that's not a very good tactic. Anyway, just so we have a safety margin, we can do this, which is, you know, it's fine. It's a little bit silly. It makes the left side of the map a little bit sillier. But you know what? It's got character. Okay, this one is weird. Because I could just pull a st stone out that way. I don't, I don't know if I like that. I mean... What if, what if it's that? 
Like, can I do that? So we're going to pull that. We're going to pull that guy back. Yeah, so we're able to do everything. In fact, we could like get rid of that whole shore line and we'd be fine. That rhymes. Um, okay. So we can't actually do that part or we lock ourselves in. We could put it there. So then I come down, I do this, I go shpoop, shpoop. Boop. And now I cannot. Oh, you know what? I didn't do all the things. It's, it's a mistake to not do all the things, guys. All right. So we do this thing. We do this thing. We do this thing. And then we bring this over and we build bridges between the people. And then we get up on the wall. Oh, but first I got to do this. I mean, this is pretty good. Problem is it's exploitable over here. The problem is the following people. I set that up. And I set this up. This is still a significant amount of the solving. But then for this part, oh, I may not, it may not be doable. Although it, if it's, if it's not doable, it's kind of not doable in a kind of a cucky way that isn't, I'm not sure that I like it. You know, um, so the idea is if I somehow put stone, stone, stone. OK, problem is I already hosed myself by pulling this off the wall. But if I just don't do that, if I use this guy instead. Whatever, we'll leave him there for a second. So we can put that there. We'll do some cuckery here. All right. We do this. And we do this. OK, now I just need one more. Um, but. You see the problem. You see, you see the problem that I am talking about. I mean, oh, I trapped myself. And then I, I dislodge that. OK, it's also kind of lame that I just set up a block on that top row. Like, what, what do I even need the mirror for then, man? You know what I'm saying? That is, that is some bullshit right there. But
I think that's fixable. Okay. Anyway, I'm worried. I'm worried about the the wall over there. So I'm just going to do one more just to make sure. Then you would need one, two, three, four stones instead of three. And, I, and that's probably not, probably not doable. All right, now here, I think if we do that, because the original reason that was shaped weird was to block you from going further to the right and whatever, but now we just, we just let you pull the thing here anywhere that you want. And then you get up and you just need a stone in there and you can't, I guess you could, you still could pull it in manually. Uh. I mean, we could put a water here <laughs> and connect this down this way. Again. But then you could pull a stone out here and go out that way. See, do you see what I'm talking about? Let's just simplify for a bit. We're simplifying. I mean, maybe that doesn't connect. The problem, the, the problem if this doesn't connect. Let's just do that for clarity. Problem if this doesn't connect is how do I get a stone in to fill that row now? Because the only way, so this is very simple and straightforward, right? Boom, easy clap. Very much more streamlined and nice. Okay, so now the problem is how do I get a stone up there without locking myself in? If I had one more row on the top, I could pull it and then get around and come back. And maybe that's the best solution. Right, like, if I could just go south again, or maybe this wall isn't here. Oh, but then you could get the mirror down if that wall isn't there, sad. spikes add spikes everybody loves spikes okay wait if I add a row to the bottom of the map let's imagine because if I add a row to the top this becomes awkward more awkward than it already is because then it's like not even in the corner anymore. But if I add a row to the bottom and that doesn't change really anything here and it shifts all this stuff, south one, then maybe that's fine. It doesn't really seem more complicated. In fact, it lets us square that up and then we've still got distance before this and then this wall can continue on.
And now there's sort of a question about where do you build the bridge? It, it, we've got an additional puzzle. Because if you build the bridge out here, you actually can't get up on the wall. Is that good? Maybe. Maybe, right? So here, here is the screw up that we have just introduced the possible, because that didn't used to be possible, right? So the point is, oh, I got to move this. The point is, this level's starting to feel big, but maybe that just means it's feeling comfortable and not, if I do that, Now, when I come to do my things, I can, I can get the feeling of success, right? But then when it comes time to get up on the wall, I cannot do it. It is not possible. All right. But if don't be like goofus, right? If I'm like Gallant and I do it here, then it is now possible, right? Oh, but I, mm, do you see the problem? Now I don't have to pull it off the fucking wall to get to the guys, which means I can come back down and do this after I broke the level, guys. I broke the level. Congratulations, me. We could put a little goblin wall over here. And that would be less weird than like a plant. I don't know. Oh no, I brought too much goblin wall. Like me, maybe that feels more natural in some way. It feels too comfy up there. Okay, why did I do that? I did that. Because you I wanted you to be able to put let's let's make sure that you oh. What what debug key is that? That one. Um I wanted you to be able to get a little guy up there without um, oh you need to be able to get around him this way to do this Is that worth maybe? Okay. Whoops, let's not block that yet. Okay, now I can't get up there. Lol. Lol.
I mean, it could be. So why am I even putting a two strip over there? Like, honestly, I can just do the following fucking thing. We can get rid of the sign. Even though it says Goblin Fortress this way, right? So pains me to get rid of it. And we could do this. Well. All right. This works fine. Then is more dramatic in some way. Maybe this is, I don't know, taller. It's a cliff. It's whatever the background is. This is actually. This is better. This is simpler and more elegant. It is now this obstacle. Okay. See, we get better at game design in life. And now it is very, very obvious to the player. You're not going to be able to get that back down. It's like you don't even have to think about maneuvering it around obstacles. It's just like, look, look, there's just like a cliff over there or something. And it is what it is. Let's try recording this for posterity. All right. So. Boom, 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 boom. I'm a boomer. Boom, boom. That one's like just for fun. So then I do this and then I go ting tang. Ting. Ooh, it's very obvious that I only get one shot. I can't even pull the mirror back south. So, like, that's fine, right? It's a little bit more forced in some way, but, like, it's also just more clear. And makes the level easier, probably. So I get up on the wall. Oh, not yet. They come down. And it's nice. It's nice to visit this place, and it's so clean now. See how clean it is? I cleaned my room, like Jordan Peterson says. Bam. I should rename this level Clean Your Room. Except we might have a level called Clean Your Room already. <laughs> clean Your Level. I like this level. It has, it has a number of good concepts in it. Is it too fucking hard? Maybe. Maybe not. It's advanced. Okay, can I exploit it? I don't think so. So we need to use at least three stones to get across. That's a given. So can I put all four other stones? Um, it might be possible. Let's try. So, okay. Three stones for the Elven Kings of Orient are. Okay. Now, we got to we got to split this stack no matter what. So we do that. Now the question is, can I 
with merely these four stones. Okay, there's one. We'll put we'll put that there for safekeeping. Um, two. Okay, I already kind of hosed myself. Maybe not. Maybe not. Because I can get that there. Oh, easy clap, guys. Sort of. Um, problem is, I did that too soon. Always try to break your own levels, everybody. Always try to break your own levels. Whoops. Always, always be breaking your levels. Okay, actually I'm fucked because I can't get the mirror down there, so we're fine. Won't the gap of three break it? I don't know what gap of three means. Why a three tile water gap instead of a two tile water gap? Because I wanted a stack of three. Put it on the gap of one and then the three on the side. I don't know what gap of one means. Guys, This you're saying things. You're, you're saying things that I don't. I don't know what they mean. If you put one where you are, and then the three left to right gap, you can do it. Th what? Yeah, you can't. The whole point of putting this up here and then having this gap is to troll you because you can't ever fill in these squares no matter what. So if you're saying just fill in those squares, then learn to play because you can't do that. If that's what everybody is suggesting, it doesn't, it doesn't work. <laughs> yeah, no, I, I, you know, it, it's a, this is actually something that probably people are unlikely to know because you would have had to have caught all the, enough of the streams to have seen this character who we haven't probably played heavily in a long time, etc. Yeah, 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 yeah. So now, is it more character? I kind of, instead of putting a cliff here, I kind of could put, remember our friend the sign? I saw the sign and it opened up my mind or whatever. Um, we could just do like that, right? The question is, is that, is that more obnoxious? <clears throat> That's a bit too clowny. I don't know. You need to have personality sometimes. Yeah, this character only pulls blocks. This character does not push. All right, so that doesn't invalidate my timings. So I think I'm good with this. I'm, I'm kind of happy how this came out. Um...
so this is the prequel. Let's try all out Goblin War again, <laughs> right? Because going from here, it's like we've got some little building footprints and stuff to here. It's like, okay. Now, now we're in trouble. Yesterday's idea worked in the end. I mean, it took some doing. I had to turn it into a different level, right? Um, like the idea yesterday, I don't know. Like I just had the idea of turning it into making a big, long elevated raised path which I think was not the idea that I had yesterday. And that just made it different enough that it wasn't just like boring, right? So we can do all out Goblin War as well. Boom. And then this level. Then we've rescued the priest and we're here. And we're escaping the Goblin Land. See, it's a story, everybody. And then we're here for some reason. Because it's also in unplaced levels. Anyway. I, I'm happy with it. This has been a good haul, guys, so far. Now. There are other trippy levels that I want to do, but I might want to go get Brekka lunch for a little bit, and then it's Counter-Strike time. So we're going to maybe have some unserious... Now, the UI hasn't fucking locked up on me this whole time that we were doing this. That's why I was running in the debugger. Sag maybe only happens in the release build. Yeah, this level, this series of levels is pretty dope. I agree with that. It came out very well. I mean, these levels could be hard. They are not for beginners. They are not for beginners. That's funny that, like, he's pretty close to killing that guy. Okay. Um, and then I just go there. Is that good? Or do we want, we want here. kind of funny how the priest just chills for a while just like thief you do the work All right. see I'm oh whoops I'm having fun playing my own levels just how you know when a game is working this level honestly is pretty hard But, you know, that's why it's a great adventure. It is a great puzzle adventure. One, two, three. Two, three, four. Okay, so we're just going to say the next five levels form something of a mini narrative adventure starring the thief with a daring rescue. <laughs> Something like that. 
Daring Rescue. Is there a certain number we're after? No, we're just trying to build out the game now. Like, the game sort of is there. Like, in terms of basic code, it's been there for a while. You know, we're just making the graphics better and stuff. Um, in terms of basic gameplay structure, it's been there mostly now. Um, in terms of... I got the idea to just do my tea right there. Um, in terms of ideas, we know basically the envelope of what all the ideas are, but like not every piece of it is filled in. And so we're just doing a little bit more levels. I mean, there's not going to be an incredibly more number of levels. It's not going to be like 2000, but it might be, uh, it might be close to 1000. Who knows? Um, maybe less. Maybe less. Yeah, what is the show match? Who is who is in the show match? Is it a bunch of boomers? Is it the Counter-Strike boomer show match? Who? What am I in for if I watch the show match? Random players. Those always suck. Like, when they do that in Dota, it's terrible. Because nobody plays together. Why would anyone do that in Counter-Strike? All right, we made seven levels so far yesterday and today. I have an idea for one more level, but um, yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take a stream break. I'm going to get food. I'm going to get prepped for the day. And then we'll come back and we'll do some combination of levels in Counter-Strike or something. All right, thank you, everybody. We'll be back in a little while. Thanks for hanging out for an hour on a short stream. We did a good level on this short stream. The whole level came together. Listen, if you just do that a thousand times, you have a fucking massive game. See, we did one one thousandth today. How great is that? In one hour. That means it only takes a thousand hours to make a video game. See you later.